So this is Dr. Scott Geller, laser floater expert, I should say. Yeah, I've been doing this a long time for eye floaters. And I have a great patient here from our local area, Fort Myers, Florida. And you had a different type of floater. I'd like to describe this. You had what's called asteroids. And asteroids uh, look like a, a, a constellation inside the gel of the eye, like little stars. That's what an asteroid is. And I suggested to you that I thought I could make things a little better. And my general opinion was 50-50 that I could do that. But you had these asteroids, and the asteroids were in some dense clumps, and what was your vision like? Because we can't measure that on an eye chart so easily. But what was your vision like before I did the laser? Well, how would you have described it? Well, it was, um, it had gotten to the point where it was sort of gray on this side. Yeah, um, you had the asteroids in one eye. Yeah. And, 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 and patients with asteroids, their visual acuity doesn't, suffer so much but the overall contrast things are a little washed out right because mm -hmm. the light bounces off these asteroids and changes the contrast sensitivity so i did what one laser session correct yes one and session. what was your impression afterwards um it uh, was it different for a little while and you know it took me a little bit to for the eye to feel back to normal it just, i mean after a couple of days Right. Oh yeah, yeah. A couple of days, it was just fine. And 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 you could see a greater contrast. How would yeah, you describe it? Yeah, I think I mean everything's clearer. It's, it's more like it would be, you know, like if you see colors and so forth. I mean, it's just brighter over here. So that's points. a great success. You know, I don't think there's too many guys out there or ophthalmology colleagues who even know about this or do it. I hope I don't drop dead tomorrow because then nobody will know about it. But uh, <laughs> you're a great patient. And, and by the way, it's uh, January 2022, in case anybody's watching this video and wants to know. And uh, it was my pleasure to do it because I really wanted to do it uh, uh, just, to, just to test my own skills <laughs> and my own uh, assumption about what could be done. But you're a great patient. Thank you. And... Uh, have a wonderful year. And you too. Thank you.